Rahim. Assalamu alaikum and greetings, Alishan Nahi here once again welcome back from the same spot I'm speaking again and again and doing videos again and again because I brought three quadcopters and I'm having fun flying those FPV quadcopters talking about FPV whoops I am actually holding one FPV whoop that is making some good name around and this is Mobula 7 from Happy Model this Mobula 7 is a brushless FPV whoop you can fly it indoors and outdoors. Before we go ahead, first off, go ahead and check out the specs for this FPV VOOP, brushless FPV VOOP. I'll fly it here for uh, line of sight first, and then goggles are ready. I will put, it, put the goggles on and enjoy some FPV whooping. Here we go. Uh, camera is recording. Oh, actually, I didn't expect it to get up that quick. So, nice. Ooh, wait. This is FPV whoop. I cannot go too far, man. Look at it. The power in this quad. Man, I'm feeling it. I'm actually feeling it. It's quiet. And it's fast. For, oh, for a whoop. Don't hit myself. <laughs> yeah, I mean... Look at it, man. For a whoop, it's really fast. I mean, you won't be doing this angle and this speed indoors, would you? Unless you are a Jedi master with those Jedi skills. Man, the amount of control this have, awesome. Now, the thing with the brushless whoops is that you can put them to acro mode which was not possible with the brushed whoops before but now some brushed whoops also have uh, acro mode because they are using the uh, you know better fly I mean the f4 f3 or uh, flight controller but with the brushless one basically you have more power more speed more performance to do uh, basically more power and torque to do these uh, flips and rolls and aerobatics basically they actually fly the same way like you would fly a bigger quadcopter, bigger FPV racer. What a sweet performance right here, man. I cannot wait to actually... Whoa, it's fast as well. I cannot wait to actually put on my video goggles and rip some speed with this whoop here. I have plenty of trees back behind me. I can actually go obstacle hunting, I mean obstacle avoidance or just some flips and rolls around myself that's gonna be fun I think so you watched the line of sight video man I'm loving it what a performer Mobula 7 is that is the reason it's actually becoming really po popular I do have the Emax Tiny Hawk which I'm waiting for extra batteries so I I don't have to charge the batteries again and again I can just you know enjoy and have fun so later I will be able to compare that with the Mobula 7 and after some time probably King Kong GT7 is coming as well also brushless FPV whoop and we will see if they actually beat the performance of Mobula 7 what a sweet machine man I'm simply loving it now the only problem with the Mobula 7 so far that I have is this one of the most fragile frames that you will ever find on on a fast and furious FPV whoop like this yeah trust me very first day when I was trying it at home I was actually just flying it in my room and I I just casually crashed it and I found one of the propeller guard snapped I had to glue it back together with some you know that powerful powerful secret glue I have for my shoes <laughs> so the frame is fixed but hey I think I need to actually go ahead and what a beautiful quad man and buy some new frames for it so that I can actually you know break the frame and just repair it and fly it again 
yeah thank you very much for telling me now you can see that I actually joined the frame here and I believe you can see it but it's opening again I hope it won't bother for now for flying it around I mean FPV around so let's just quickly do FPV before I actually you know rip the frame apart and had to buy a new frame You know what to do. Hit that like button. It's right there. I know you can do it. Oh, while you're at it, also hit the subscribe button. Right there. Come on, don't be shy. Just hit it. Thank you very much for all your support towards my work that I post regular and fresh content on my channel just for you. Hit that like button.